it's your boy Gruff here, back with another video, and today, I got special for you guys, man, today we're going to be talking about the best equipments for the new LF Namek Super Saiyan Goku, now, this is pre-recorded, because I don't have the Goku, and I'm probably not going to summon for him, but I can definitely filter out some of the equipments from the units that share the same tags, and give you guys some of the best equipments for them, and everything like that, so if you guys do enjoy these type of videos, Subscribe to the channel, leave a like, road 15k, without further ado, let's get on with it. So, yeah, these are kind of like the four units, because he kind of stares like Sun Fam, and then he has like Blue Saiyans, and all that good stuff, and Freeza Force with Captain Ginyu. So, with these four units, I can kind of basically come up with the top equipment for him, since we know that he is a strike, he's a blue unit, you know that he's strike based as well, so then we also know some good things about him as well. So, yeah, let's, without further ado, let's get on with it. I don't think it's going to be that too long of a video. But there is probably going to be a, a awakened equipment that drops for him. So, like I said, this is pre-recorded. You guys see here, we actually go to the events. We can go to recommend. You guys see that Zenkai USTR is actually resetting tonight. So, that's probably going to be a great chance that they're going to awaken equipment that might be catered around high strike attack and special move cards. So, I might probably not add that in there because it's pre-recorded. But just know that there's probably going to be another good equipment that I'm probably going to miss out on because the Zenkai USTR is resetting and usually they're going to drop a new equipment so they're probably going to be something that's going to be really powerful in terms of strike attack, special move, or even ultimate so if this is really good I might just pin the comment and say this is also another good equipment for them but just want to you know, let y'all know that hey there's probably another equipment that I'm going to miss out on most likely because it's going to be awakened so these are the equipments that's really good for them now and let's get started let's get on with the peer equipment so i'm gonna start off with the peer equipment peer equipment are going to be equipment that has these type of wordings right here like say for example like this Ginyu force one this isn't equipment for him but this is for Ginyu force for example like yeah the peer strike and blast attack like that wording right here that's going to be those are peer equipment so as long as you have high base strike attack on your teams these peer equipment going to make him his strike damage hit even harder so the first equipment is actually going to be this co-op equipment if you do want to rock a mode of peer Freeza Saga team, so maybe like him, Ginyu, and Goto, maybe him, Ginyu, Jason Burner, maybe, you know, just saying like him, Ginyu, just like a full Freeza Saga team, because I think he actually does buff Freeza Saga on his Z ability. This equipment will be really good. Special move damage, he actually has a powerful blue card damage for sure. And then peer equip, like I said, you have three Freeza Saga members, strike defense, up to 15 peer strike, and then 15 peer blast, and then blast defense. So if you want to rock him on a peer Freeza Saga, this is the equipment that you guys can go after for sure. If you want to rock them like him, Ginyu, and Goro, I think that's going to be a really good, nice trio right there. So if you want to rock them on that team, definitely want to farm those equipment for sure. So that's one peer equipment down. Now in terms of his strike equipments, bro, uh, if you want to rock them on, if you want to rock them on a peer Sun Fam team, so maybe like him, Goku, Freeza, and Pan, you want to rock them on a, on a peer Sun Fam team. This equipment is actually going to be really good here. So this equipment is this one right here it's called it's all you go so it's double defense but then at the slot three is up to five percent peer strike attack for each sun family battle member so that's gonna be really nice so he's gonna get up to 15 peer on the sun fan team me, me personally i think that's probably gonna be the best three sun fam units pan him and then goku frieza so he's gonna get up to 15 peer strike on that team so that's actually really good in terms of his peer strike then after that i think he has two more strike peer peer strike attacks for real because yeah, he has, he has two more peer strikes. So these ones only gives up give him up to ten, unfortunately, but they're still peer. So let's actually get into it. So we're gonna go here, and I actually want to talk about this equipment. So if you do want to rock, I think Goku Frieza is gonna probably gonna be his best partner for sure. This new Alec Namek Goku, like you can just rock him on T.O.P. I mean Uni Rep, Leader Slot him. Then you can rock him on Sans together. You can rock him on Sun Family together. You could just Leader Slot just go Frieza on Frieza Saga with him getting you and the go freeze so this equipment here is actually not that bad if you're pairing him up with go freeze because he's getting health then he's getting pure blast and he's getting pure strike because of sun fam and then freeze force battle member or even if you pair him up with the ginyu the ginyu will be able to give him the pure strike as well so if you're gonna rock him on the freezer saga team with the ginyu force he's g't be able to get the pure strike you know you don't even, you don't even need to rock the goku freeze because he's already a sun fam unit so he's getting the blast so you just need a freeze force unit to give him the strike and then you can get this and then he's getting help so this is actually a really nice equipment as well in terms of appear he's getting blast and strike which is only 10 percent but it is a pure and then this last but not least 
is the 10 man equipment. So this one gives them pure strike when the melee is a battle type member. When there's a battle member that's melee type, he's a melee type, so that's gonna apply to himself, but he's getting 10 pure, so it's probably arguably the worst one out of all the peers, but these are all the peers I think that he has, if I remember correctly. So I think those are the only pure four peers that he gets, but other than that, you could actually add in this equipment here if you're pure strike, if you pair him up with a purple or region member. So you wanna rock him, you can actually add in this equipment as well. If you're rocking with Ginyu or you're rocking with what's name, but he has better equipments than this equipment here. But I guess this is another equipment that I totally forgot about. But yeah, those are probably the five peers. And without further ado, let's get into the base strike. So let's go talk about the base strike attack. Best base strike equipments for him. So this one is going to be his number one. If you guys have been playing Legends Ranking, you guys can get those Legends Ranking medals and then go to the exchange shop and then exchange for this. This gives him off to 45 base strike. That's arguably the highest base strike in terms of equipment that he can use and then he's getting 30 base strike defense you know this meta is strike heavy so having that extra 30 defense for strike is really nice and then he's getting 45 base strike so that's really nice for his attack so that's gonna be really good this is probably his best base best his best base strike equipment is gonna be this equipment right here this awaken plat if you guys hopefully you guys so that it would be should have one of these especially with the raid coming out we're going to have two raids, I believe, so we're going to have a lot of erasers, so hopefully you can at least get one of these fully maxed out so you guys can get him up in high 45 base strike attack. That's really powerful. So next equipment is going to be this equipment here. So the fact that this is for Blue Sun, I mean Blue Sun Family, he's a Blue Sun Family member, so I mean the fact that he's going to get up to 37, if you have it maxed out, 37.5 base strike, but he's getting a 12.5 special move is actually really nice because... His blue card damage does do a lot, especially when his gauge is filled, his blue card is going to do a lot of damage. So if you want to focus more on maybe less strike and maybe you don't have that equipment, that that Awakened Jiren Plat equipment, you can go for this equipment here. It's Awakened. Like I said, we have raids, so we have a lot of erasers. You guys can re-roll and everything and hopefully get a good roll for this. But, you know, 12.5 special move and 37.5 base strike is really nice. So that's a really good equipment right there. So next equipment is actually going to be this equipment. This equipment is actually not that bad. It gives a little bit of some, he gets 20 base blast. And I think it gives up the 20 strike defense. So that's not, that's pretty good because you're facing, this a strike heavy meta. And then his strike attack is only up to 33 compared to the other ones. So it's a little bit lower, but it is not a bad equipment as well. I mean, high base blast and defense up to 20. That's not bad. And then 33 base strike, not a bad equipment at all. This is a really solid awakened equipment. So that's the equipment I, I definitely recommend for him. Then after that, bro, we have these Rice's Saiyan's equipment. So this, we actually have two because the fact that he has an ultimate card and he has a blue card that's actually not bad. So you can either pick either or me personally. You can go with the double strike so you get up to 33 base strike but then he's getting 12 ultimate damage which is really good. Or you can actually get this equipment here. I don't know words of that. You can get the special move side where you can do the double strike attack and then the special move. So it's 12 special move and then 33 base strikes. So me personally I think if you was to rock this equipment I'll go more for the ultimate damage so you can make sure he's one shining people as much as possible, especially since he can stack his damage up super high. You probably want to focus on the ultimate damage, make sure that it's going to really kill a unit, especially when his gauge is full, 100% sustained damage cut. That's going to be really powerful. That's going to be powerful hitting ultimate cards. So if you do want to rock this equipment, I'll probably go for the ultimate compared to the special move side. So another slept on equipment is actually going to be this equipment here. This might not be bad for him because he does have a special move and he does have an ultimate damage card. He does have ult card and a special move damage. And then I believe that every time he lands a card, he gets his vantage gauge up. So this equipment is not actually, is actually might be a sleeper. I don't know how many people are going to like this equipment, but if you want to add it in, you can. This is actually a pretty valuable equipment because he has a special move damage and his ultimate damage. He has an ultimate card and a special, and a blue card. And then his vantage gauge, I think he... Something where I think I don't know if it's, every time he lands a card he gets his vantage gauge, so just kind of just increases it up a little bit more. That's really nice. And then his strike defense, you can't never go wrong with this. So this equipment is actually pretty slept on that equipment, but I don't know if a lot of people are going to value it. But I just wanted to add it in there just because. So other than that, bro, I think there's two more equipments that I actually want to show you guys, bro. I think there's one that's the Freezer Saga. There's two Freezer Saga equipments. I actually, probably have to go through the Ginyu right here just to show you guys i think i actually don't even have it actually let me show you guys where is it at yeah so we have this equipment here this one's not bad i think you get this from the z metal shop so this is up to 35 base strike and then you get up to 
10 strike defense. So I think it's okay if you just really care about just having high strike attack. 35 and then 10 strike defense is okay, but it's not really one of the top tier ones, but it's not a bad sub optimal equipment for sure. So then after that, we're probably gonna wrap this video up with this equipment here. We're gonna finish it up with this equipment. I actually don't have this equipment. I don't have any, uh, I don't have any equipments here. I don't have any one in my equipment slots and stuff, but if you guys did play the last PvP season that for that exchange shop, you can definitely go. If you do have this, it's actually not that bad for me. The only problem is that it's only for seven stars or above, so you have to summon, you have to pull two, three copies of him, or have two copies and put like 600 Z power down to give him a seven star. So this is restricted for seven stars and above. But if you do have my seven stars higher, 20 strike attack, 30, I mean 20 strike defense, 30 strike attack, and then 10 base health. It's pretty good, you know what I'm saying? Get him health, make him tank here, 30 strike attack, it's not that bad, and then 20 strike defense, it's not that bad. So, pretty solid unit, I mean, pretty solid equipment, and that's pretty much it for this video. Like I said, it's probably gonna be a really powerful equipment awakening for him. That's gonna be catered around, like maybe Frieza Saga melees or something related to the Goku or whatever it is. So, that equipment's probably gonna be really cracked for him, but uh, these are the equipments for now. Um, hopefully, this equipment guide helped. For sure, and let me know what you guys think about the equipment that he has. And hopefully, you guys don't get shafted, and hope you guys do pull up. So, yeah, that's it with the video. Subscribe to the channel, like, comment, subscribe, and grill, man. I'm out. Peace.